So it depends on depends on the type of disease. So, so TGP has two types. One is called a congenital, meaning so you have a gene that is mutated. So your Adam TS thirteen enzyme is not made and secreted into your blood, right? So you actually was born with the Adam TS thirteen deficiency. So you may have disease. In that case, you can actually uh, do so called prophylactic treatment before you get pregnant and during the pregnancy, you know, and throughout the pregnancy. So it's actually, you can actually uh, get pregnant and get through the pregnancy safely without any consequences. As long as you know, you have DTP, you do the prophylaxis. The, the question is the, the, the other type of TTP, let's say you have acquired TTP, which is you out of the blue, you get this, this antibody against your enzyme adamtia 13 In this case, I would say you want to wait until the antibody is going away and then the enzyme comes back. So at least in remission, then you can go, to, go, go on and get pregnant, right? If a pregnancy somehow induced the antibody production again, then we can deal with that. Well, we can still do plasma exchange. And as long as you do plasma exchange, you know, you, you treat them, you'll be fine, you'll be fine too. Um, I think, you know, pregnancy, uh, the TTP is not the absolute country indication for getting pregnant. Pregnancy could be a, 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 a trigger for TTP if you have no MTS 13 to begin with, right? Say you may have, you may feel fine if you don't have MTS for a long time, you don't even know. And then when you get pregnant, you suddenly your, your system kind of, you know, kind of flare up, have to work much, much harder. So you have stress in your body and your fungal burn factor and the serial cell may be activated. So you dump more substrate that the cause plate is sticking together. But then if you don't have an MTS-13, you can't handle that, then you have disease. So that's how a lot of patients actually discover they have congenital TTP after they get pregnant. You know, they never know they had a TTP until that point. So pregnancy, basically, so MTS deficient already puts you on the side of the cliff. So pregnancy just push you off the cliff. So you get disease, okay? The other trigger could be inflammation or infection. So let's say you get a GI, you get a diarrhea for a couple of days or a urinary tract infection a couple of days, or you just get a cold, you know, like, like, uh, like flu. That could also push you off the cliff. So pregnancy is not the only one that push you off, off the cliff, okay? That's why, you know, but, but if you already know that you have, you have congenital TTP, that's okay. We can, we can do prophylaxis, no problem. 